The first lady of Florida, Casey DeSantis, is diagnosed with breast cancer. The governor's office making that announcement earlier today. Good evening, I'm Todd McDermott. And I'm Felicia Rodriguez. Thank you for joining us. The announcement came in a message from Governor Ron DeSantis himself. The governor saying, quote, I am saddened to report that Florida's esteemed first lady and my beloved wife has been diagnosed with breast cancer. As the mother of three young children, Casey is the centerpiece of our family and has made an impact on the lives of countless Floridians through her initiative as first lady. Our Gianna Caserta is live now with a reaction to the announcement and she has a reminder from a local doctor about the importance of annual screenings. Gianna. Well, breast cancer is the second most common cancer among women here in the United States. And now Florida's first lady, Casey DeSantis, is now part of that statistic. It's the word no one wants to hear from their doctor's mouth, cancer. At just 41 years old, Florida's first lady, Casey DeSantis, has been diagnosed with breast cancer. The announcement comes during Breast Cancer Awareness Month and serves as a reminder of just how important it is to get your yearly mammograms. We're definitely prepared to have a large number of people coming through to get their screenings done. It's easy for people to remember when everything is lit up pink and everyone is wearing pink. So and we do have policy where you can just walk in and get a screening mammogram um, as a self referred patient. So we do see a lot of people come through in October. Governor DeSantis released a statement about his wife, reading in part, as she faces the most difficult test of her life, she will have not only my unwavering support, but the support of our entire family, as well as the prayers and well wishes from Floridians across our state. Casey is a true fighter and she will never, never, never give up. During the pandemic, some people postpone their yearly screenings and checkups, and doctors are reminding their patients now is the time to reschedule. Please don't put off your screening mammogram at this point. Everyone has waited a long time, and things that we don't like to see, like later stage cancers, because people waited, um, we're, we're past the waiting stage at this point. We feel like COVID may be with us for a while. We don't know how long. But at this point, for us here, it's business as usual. The DeSantis family immediately received an outpouring of support, including from Attorney General Ashley Moody. Florida loves its first lady. She is dynamic, great spirit, uh, but she's a faithful person. And I know with, with prayer and the support of Floridians behind her, uh, she will get through this. And doctors at Good Samaritan Medical Center go on to say they re recommend every woman over the age of 40 get a mammogram every single year. For now reporting live, I'm Gianna Caserta, WPBF 25 News.